first stop in Asheville, North Carolina is at Lexington Glassworks. This is definitely a place to check out if you're looking for something unique. Let's go on inside and uh, should be able to watch them making glass and they've got their artwork for sale here. Today we're visiting the Western North Carolina Nature Center and this is a place that I found when um, when we travel I'm looking for places that we can visit that are affordable that are unique to the area and sometimes it's kind of an eclectic mix of just Google searches or looking through TripAdvisor or I use Road Trippers a bit and that website offers suggestions for nearby attractions and features and this is one that I found um, through road trippers but because we have purchased a membership through um, science museum reciprocal um, relationships we have the opportunity to visit here for free because of a science museum that we purchased a membership through back in Spokane Washington so that's been a helpful way for us to see some unique places without having to pay an extra admission fee so I'm not really sure what they have here, but the reviews made it sound like it was a great place for kids and it involved some outdoor local nature. And so we're gonna check it out because today's a nice sunny day and the next few days are gonna be kind of rainy. So we wanted to capitalize on the good weather. This is not a job that I would enjoy at all. Me either. That's not a job. Remember, Mark Fletcher was the biggest tennis player? I'm on the little sofa. Let's just keep it. 
like just swallow it. Oh, yeah. so swallow In Costa Rica, they had this huge, big uh, yeah. anaconda boa. Uh, boa can fix it. It was a big boa, and they had just started a chicken. Oh, old chicken. And they no, opened the thing chickens. up so we could touch, we could touch the snake. Yes. Yeah, they, they, no, they dropped oh, them down. They three seconds are in their belly. <laughs> The, guy, the one that you're actually here to see. His name is Art, or Artemis, we call him Art, and he is a barred owl. Thank you guys for waiting and not crowding him. I really appreciate that. He appreciates it too. <laughs> so it's a beautiful day here at the Western North Carolina Nature Center. Uh, early spring. Today was in the 70s. Luckily, it's, uh, spring is happening early this year, so we got lucky. But this is a great smaller zoo to come to. It's not too large, as you can't see it all in one day, and you can spend a lot of time just going to the different places, seeing the different animals, and relaxing, sitting, letting the kids play around, because there's multiple playgrounds in it, as you saw. But uh, everything is very well kept. Uh, the snake enclosure is probably one of the best I've seen because the snakes are all clean, the enclosures are clean, the glass is really clean, making it really easy to see the snakes. The outdoor enclosures are, uh, are neat too. Lots of different types of animals like cougars, saw black bears, uh, different types of fox, and coyotes. They had different shows going on like otter show and owls. There's just a lot going on here. So if you have a chance, I'd highly recommend coming out and checking it out. What you doing, Tanner? You building things? No. No? Just playing? Yeah. Cool. So one neat thing about this park in addition to the animals, they have a lot of play areas for the kids. This is just one. Uh, there's probably about four or five. Good in a whole play structure. Good for getting some energy out. 